character, so even his losing matchups aren't that terrible. Mm -hmm. But still a tough matchup for, for Rob. Um, we're going to see here Carflow, a player that is incredibly aggressive. Um, the style of Roy is I'm clicking buttons in your face because they're all like minus five or less. <laughs> um, and good luck. He's not afraid though. He's definitely one of those in your face characters, one of yeah. those in your face players, actually. And you're seeing that right now. He's unafraid to get on uh, up on double shield, and there was no punish off of the whip up B, unfortunately. But there we go. Double, uh, um, triple down tilt already onto Carflow. But there we go. Is now F tilt on ledge. And. Gr Jaro in hand, not doing anything with him, unfortunately. Now he's a little more patient and within the grab, allowing Dill some more punish game. Also, Dill is a snake. Just a snake? Hiss. It's his angry thing. Oh my god, cat? wait, why is it not egg? Oh, so it's a little cat. No, it's always egg. Cat's his too. <laughs> um, either way. Okay, here uh, we go. <laughs> oh, you die! You're dead! Oh. Yes! Before that, it was like what? 60 something? 60 something? That was 50. That was 50 before the hit. Oh my god. Rob is one yeah, of the 50. heaviest characters in the game. Okay, so Carvel, after um, you know being in disadvantage for a lot of the second half of that stock, um, one neutral win against Rob in the corner. And again, if you thought that Palu was good in the corner, oh uh, boy. Roy is even more oppressive. Um, because Roy is even less minus than Palo is. Yep. Um, and, and certainly... Yeah, okay, well. tough to deal with. But in that situation, Carful probably clicked a button after fairing shield there. Uh, Rob, actually, Rob Mustache is really fast, though. You might, might have just been able to be like an actual punish there. Because um, especially the spacing looked a little high on Rob's shield. But it's a, a advantage that, that bigger bodies do have, is that a lot of characters hit their shield higher, so things are more negative on their shield. You're absolutely right, but here we go. Carflow once again trying to get Dill off on the ledge, and now we're kind of skirmishing for that control over that that, that stage positioning, and it might be Carflow right now really attempting to contest Dill off the ledge. But unfortunately, you know what Rob does have over Roy that air uh, mobility and that air uh, speed. Yeah. So here we go. Dill was trying to come back on ledge with that up air, but try again and miss a little bit. Right yeah. there. And Dill did such an excellent do job getting out of those positions there. Mm -hmm. um, you saw that first she uh, spot dodged the F tilt after getting back on the stage, rolled back on a jab, and then when uh, Carful tried to turn around and grab immediately afterward, jumped away. Like, really great defensive play by, right there by Dill to get out of those situations. All right, did you get punished? There's the punish right there. We missed, we missed it early, but here it is, getting that uh, up B punish with the up air. I really want to see Dill go in for some more um, more back air, some more aerial play as well. That side B was trying to get to what I was talking about earlier, but we will be punishing instead with the gyro and gyro in hand. Whiffing the dare, I think, I think that shifted her hurtbox away from uh, Carpo's attack. Oh, uh, yeah, no job. Okay. Mm -hmm. So in that, in that position there, tougher Roy to get back. That is certainly one thing that Rob absolutely does have in the matchup. It is a little bit tougher Roy to get back to stage in the matchup. Okay. There's good there, punish there. Goes for a bear. I think that was probably a uh, turnaround fair attempt, in all honesty, because bear is really slow in that position. But mm -hmm. could have been a near dodge read as well. Um, however, Dill going oh, wow. to go down yeah. there. That up air, obviously very strong on the sweet spot. Um, I we're going to be even this game right back up. Yeah, but biggest thing Dill's going to have an advantage today yeah. is this ledge game. If she's able to continue it, but unfortunately, Carful is going to be able to con convert it into his own his own uh, advantage state yeah. until that grab onto the platform right there. You have to DI Rob's up throw out there. Um, at, at these percentages, I don't think fair is Ooh. true anymore. So uh, at this point, you have to DI those out to make sure you're not getting up here and juggled even more. Jump, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Carpo was waiting for the up air uh, recovery on the ledge right there just to avoid it. And unfortunately, he got hit with the gyro instead. Yeah. Excellent parry in the air. Definitely a tough position to deal with, but once you have the matchup knowledge check there, yep. um, like you know the position. Obviously, Rob has like a lot of timing mix-ups. Oh wow! Dead? Not quite. Um, yeah. Oh, you're dead right there. So right. that's that's, yeah. that's um, great recognition both times by uh, Dill. You saw that as Carful drifted in for the fair, she was immediately ready with the up smash, and that happened yep. twice that game. Um, so here specifically, for some round one, that trade is really funny. Rob Backer is real, like, hilarious, and so is Roy F. Tilt. So in this position specifically, you're going to see one. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> it's a long difference. Oh, it's a lot. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Which one is funnier here? What is... <laughs> Yeah, I saw it was like, okay, wait, actually, back air. It, yeah. it, it, it was back air being the funny one there, not, not a Roy move. Uh, Rob yeah, back is big, air. but it's because uh, Roy detailed extended mm -hmm. in, so that's exactly why that happened. Um, but yeah, and well, recognition to know that. Uh, not enough time here to go over the, 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 the fair positioning, but that's okay. Um, it, it was just essentially just that, like, 
Dill was, 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 was like recognized the drift in immediately twice and just hit the uh, the fair with uh, up smash. It was just good, good recognition by Dill. Mm -hmm. All right, definitely at TNC, I definitely understand why we are going to the stage. Definitely one of Rory's preferred stages, but it's also Rob's. Um, kind of for the same reasons that Puffin plays really, really imperative Ooh. in both of their uh, aggressive game plans. And getting Ooh, hit that last so the smart. side B, I love so that side. I love that side B there just because um, Dill knows that Carflow is jumping in, uh, but not with like a full hop or anything, with a short hop. Ooh. Love the use of the gyro there to you know to kind of disguise her recovery back on the stage. Mm -hmm. But fortunately, we're getting that first dog over towards Carflow. Yeah, and we're platformless right now. And, like the only misplay in that situation when it comes to getting into the stage is and, like what you'll see Zamba do in that position a lot um, on the jab lock. Dill de dill de dill de dill de tilted. That's a tongue twister. Um, <laughs> and uh, in that position, uh, Zamba ja jabs to get the yes. jab lock. Right. That's true. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, they definitely did prefer to down to okay, uh, train her opponents. No. Up throw, waiting out the mash, absolutely. Waiting out the mash for the up there. 70. Holy, mm -hmm. the DI was incredible. We're back. Now we're placed, though, even on town where up throw will start killing. Uh, I definitely see why Dill did not go for up throw in that position. You know, 160 is just kind of the yes. uh, the range where it stops, where go. it's not, just barely not killing on town, especially without any rage. Mm -hmm. um, oh, this is big damage. Okay, not quite going to go for a full extension there. Uh, platform there, eating the gyro, which is huge, and that gives a huge conversion yep, yes. for car flow. We're back. Oh, but you're dead. So. Oh, go on. That is very much uh, like <laughs> the, and I, I, I tried to get into it a little bit last time. Not that is the deal. Have it is to uppy, get to the like little lip of the stage, and then jump and carful read it. Car so like Dill has that habit where Dill will get to the lip of the stage and then go for the jump mix up with Rob, like a jump fair in. Mm -hmm. Just hard read by Carflow. Yeah, props to Carflow for that humongous read on his part. Now he's a really good advantage today against uh, Dill. A whole stock up ahead, actually. But right now, should not be taking it quite yet. With excellent day and also just high ceiling stages that TNC offers to both players. Uh, gyro in hand, beautiful, but missing the Ooh. side B after the Z drop gyro, and, unfortunately. And that gyro Z drop was super, was super duper ambiguous there. Yeah. Um, I thought it was going on stage for sure, and so did Carflow. Ends up getting hit by it on the ledge. Um, that's great, yeah. Okay, so I think yep. so it takes the stock. So we, to the platform. so we are in a position here where you know Dill has been able to rack up the damage. However, Carflow is getting stocks real early this game. So Dill's gonna have to mount this damage, mount this comeback really quickly um, to get this percent back before Carflow gets it. Oh that's huge. There's no way, yeah. There's, yep. That's twice. Yeah. Man, why does he get that? It's TNC. <laughs> what what that, that killed on, TNC. on that killed it's Roy TNC. Okay, it's T it's TNC. It's Roy TNC. But that killed on Stadium at 50 before. Obviously, I'll be at a lot more rage. But the parry, obviously, on landing. Then here, you have to time it. It is like a timing thing where you have to do it a little bit slower. If you do it fast, you don't get the full hits. You want to time it so that you hit the third hit as you hit the floor. Um, Carful times it well. And we're going to game three. But yeah. Let's see where we're Roy, I mean, yeah, PS2. Roy makes me angry. I forget how much. Angry? I, I forget how much I'm like, man. Roy is is cool sometimes, and then He's I'm so like, cool. man, and Roy is a angry. cheeser, and I'm like, but you know what? I can respect cheese. I like cheese. I like a good cheese every once in a while. Cheese is so fun. So I love like, being a troll. like, look, I, I played heavy, so like, I can't say anything. But um, yeah, you play heavies. Heavies are sick. They're so are, cool. Heavies are cool. Anyway, uh, we're going right into game number three. Uh, and this is, this is what I was mentioning earlier, actually, in the Heretta set, like, just like stalling and like waiting to get back onto the floor, especially against characters that have like oppressive, like you know, not necessarily grounded game, but just speed against Rob. You want to wait to get down to the floor. You don't want, just want to give them things. Okay, S smash, oh. nice, solid punish. Yeah, huge, huge uh, use of the gyro to get the S smash nice. out from uh, car flow. Should be seeing another side beat. Yep, absolutely. On the neutral getter. That's a, that's a neutral getter breed there. That's just like knowing the habits of the player. Mm -hmm. uh, I would like to have just seen fair oh, there on that. the startup, but uh, I, I like the idea from Dill still. All right, Carpo had to struggle to get back on stage. Nice, nice full hug from the ledge to, in order to avoid the up air. I'm sorry, not up air. <laughs> Ooh, smash. Okay, missed the tech, but did not get sweet spotted there, so it does live. Ooh, and oh, read, nice. the, read the jump in, but Carflo does it as well on the back air. Just gets the dead. Still not quite. The Carflow has had the DIs on those today. Has not messed one up yet. Mm -mm. Okay, that's gonna be a punish. Oh! That, that comboed because of Gyro. I don't know if it comboed, but it was really close. Um, I thought Gyro was gonna interrupt him from that uh, animation. Yeah, no, because the Gyro 
put him on the floor. Yeah. Which allowed up tilt to come out immediately. I'm sure that was honestly probably like a buffer jump up air. Mm -hmm. um, not up tilt. It could have been up tilt though. Um, and still, up tilt definitely yeah. kills there. But then, <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll ignore that one. Uh, so so that, that, that there was enough there. Um, immediate up E on the gyro on shield. Nice by Carflow. And the parries have been on point as well. Parrying those nares, parrying those backers from Rob. Oh, uh, this is, is this huge damage? Oh no, missing the gyro connection, but we're maybe connecting it. It's no, tough it. there. It's tough there because what you have to do in that position is you have to Z drop the gyro to hit it, and then immediately afterward fastball the nair to hit the yeah. top part of the nair, um, so you can get a combo a follow, combo follow up afterward. You're, you're definitely not getting a zero to death in that position. Um, mixing up the timing there to deal with the nair. Okay, has Patience. to land. I love the push from Carflow right there in that moment. Um, unfortunately, we're getting that, that back there from Dilnor to and there's that stinks. air dodge off stage, and that's Carflow's second stock just from, unfortunately, not able to come on stage safely enough. Now we have Dil in a pretty comfortable position. This is going to be a good rage active at the moment. Ooh, big damage here. That's yeah. huge. Yep, you're absolutely right. Oh, nice. But air dodge is okay. through the fair. So the, 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 the DI makes up on, on up there, obviously. Um, Carvel has been showing DI in thus far, um, but it does it again in that position, and it pays off because the fair whiffs. Yep. Nice patience, yeah, with the nair, yeah. absolutely. Carful has made it very tough for Dill to get back to stage. Yeah. Um, has not been messing around a ledge, and when Dill messes up by ledge, uh, Carful gets a stock. So, again, we're going to see a position here. Is Carful going to be able to get the, those, you know, explosive start uh, combos here? Or is Dill going to control the corner? We yeah, have one yep, here, yeah. Yep. I was going to say, Carful is playing way more patient. You're seeing him not run in too often. Yep. You're seeing him very much stand right there, shield him whenever needed to, and play wisely to his uh, the space that Dill is allowing him to have. Okay. And again, we're seeing that right now. Carful wisely grab grabbing the gyro, dropping it down. Oh, and we now are, we're playing for space. Yeah, we are in a position here where in the corner, um, Jab, Saibi will absolutely do it. Mm -hmm. um, with all this rage, uh, yeah, you're dying. Uh, however... Oh, I, I understood the setup she was going for, but it just simply, I think it was just too much rage and the. Yeah, gy gy was gyro, much. gyro is facing the wrong way. So gy yeah, Gyro too. will always send out in a specific, whatever direction Rob is facing. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, Gyro was facing the wrong way. Tries to get a tech roll in. Dill does not bite. Um, it trying to get back to center stage now. Is Carful does manage to get these the sour hit of the nair. <gasps> ah, that was scary. Okay, yeah. that could have been humongous for Carfo, but nice, nice recognition from Dill to air, air dodge back towards the uh, left side. Okay, yeah, uh, just yeah, you have to just grab there. Um, get, get back into advantage. Carful's been so, so good in advantage thus far. Yeah. And reads the jump up, and Carful is going to take it. 2-1 over Dill. And this is, again, this is just super basic stuff in terms of, like, what Carful did, but, like, super smart. Just... It was all you know, just reaction. Sharking yeah. under plat, mm -hmm. and then just reading the double jump, like yep. the, uh, the jump up immediately afterward, right? With, with a double jump, um, just super smart stuff in that position. Um, here. Just slowing down whenever he was yeah. in a very so precarious situation. The, 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 this specific situation here. Yeah. <laughs> one, it was sick. Two, um, but if we go, uh, look, I'll let the replay run through so you can see it again. So in this position, Dill's gonna side be and be in a ton of lag, right? So car flow is going to Nair. Nair does not catch the gyro, which I think is actually what maybe Carflow may have intended. But either way, doesn't catch the gyro, meaning the hitbox is still active to hit, and the gyros are here, it's kind of hiding. Right there. Um, so the, the um, Nair here rifts, meaning Carflow gets hit. Carflow is going to get sent to the left of the stage here as soon as he gets hit. So we're gonna see Nair one's gonna hit. Nair one hits, gyro's about to hit. Gyro hits. I'll go back a couple frames here. So Gyro then hits Carflow, sending him this way. And then immediately afterward, because Gyro ha is, um, sends him at a downward like angle here, Carflow also hits the floor and then immediately can click up tilt. Yeah. So like, yeah. So in that position, because like the Nair was kind of high like like before that. Like the Nair was like looked like it probably wasn't gonna go into like true true combo into anything there. Just because it looked like there was a fast fall immediately afterward. But because of the gyro, Carful hits the floor instantly, gets an up tilt out, yep. takes a stock. Um, and yeah, just overall good stuff. I love Smash Bros. if you can't tell. <laughs> love Smash Bros. I've, it's been too long since I've been able to commentate. Like, in like, situation specific stuff is very cool. Um, we're going to have a lot of situations.